This is the craziest story in baseball right now. I literally never seen anything like it. So what we're going to do is we're going to watch this video and then we're going to talk about it after. And if you're new here, I'm former MLB player Jermaine Curtis. OK, so now let's watch this video. Here's a scene setter for you. It was top of the sixth in a seven inning game. So the pitch to is Weatherford's Owen Woodward. The Backside. TC's Josh Phillips. Apple Taco. Gives NCTC <laughs> the lead. Phillips doesn't appear to be slow trotting or showboating as he runs second base, but watch the pitcher, Woodward. He slams his glove on the ground and then sprints toward and flattens. Oh, oh, my. Oh, Ooh. no. Oh, no. Eventually, the umpire Ooh. suspended the game. Weatherford's wow. head baseball coach said in a Twitter statement that the team is shocked Ooh. and disappointed he had whip and completely blash. embarrassed and that the pitcher, Ooh. Woodward, could even be expelled from school. We haven't heard anything about injuries, but Ooh. both players were up and walking around right after the incident. So there's a few things I want to do now. I want to break this down. Let's go back a little bit. So he says it's the sixth inning. They're only playing seven innings. This is game one. The score is two to one. And this is a high pressure situation. In the beginning of the game, the game just starts flowing. But at the end of the game, it, it gets intense. You can feel the pressure building up and especially in tight games. And I guarantee you, these guys were talking crap to each other nonstop. And this guy hits a backside bomb, which I have to say, you got to give props when props is due. You know how hard it is to hit a backside homer on Apo Taco? So he goes Apo Taco, and then he's running around the bases. But here, he's not showboating or anything, but he does say something. And I know it because you got to look at the umpire. Pay attention to him. He's watching him touch the bag, and then you'll see him point at him the runner is saying something at this moment he's saying something to the pitcher the umpires usually don't say anything so the player is really instigating this so now the pitcher hears what's going on and then he slams his glove and then he goes right after him and now the runner isn't expecting this because nobody on the field is expecting this i played third base and i never seen anything like this i have never ever seen anything like this pitcher goes all in on his target and just flattens him just straight flattens him i feel bad i don't condone this by any means i'm just breaking this down and we're talking about this and we're sharing this story oh he was hit hard that remind me of like wwe spearing a person just straight head whiplash gone look at the third baseman Look at the third baseman. We gotta go back a little bit. Look at the third baseman. Let's look from his point of view. Guy goes Apo Taco. Okay, he goes Apo Taco. You're at third base and you're like, um, oh, this could be a double off the wall. Oh, uh, nope, it's a homer. Put your head down and say, dang, we're down by one now. Cause this is North Central just hit the home. We're down by one. So now you're just like, ah, all right, we gotta get him next inning. So you're just over there. You're just walking thinking you know nothing's happening okay you turn around you look at the runner and all of a sudden now you start looking at your pitcher and you're like confused on what's going on like what is happening right now i i don't what what then boom you jump up because you don't know what the heck just happened you're confused you're and then look at him look at look at it look at his hands to his face he's like oh my god like did that really just happen? I've never seen anything like that. That was the wildest thing I've seen on the baseball field. Whew. And now I want to say, if you're a pitcher, do hit an apple taco off you. You gotta give them. You gotta give them your respects. You, you gotta. You gotta be like, all right. You gotta just wear it. He won the battle. Now, if you're a player, you don't even need to say anything after that. You just hit an apple taco. You don't need to talk. So for all you players out there, you're going to talk smack to each other. And that's part of it. That competitor mindset. That's competing in the batter's box and on the mound. I love that. That's what it's about. But if you lose, take it. Just take it. And don't. you don't need to say anything. You don't need to talk more smack. You did your job. If you struck them out, pitcher, you did your job. You could do maybe a little something like a little praise, but then go into the dugout. If you hit the homer, just trot around the bases. You did your job. You put your team up one. You don't need to continue talking. Talking crap it does nothing all it does is 
get someone even madder and they're gonna wanna spear you. This story was crazy. And again, if you enjoyed this, hit that like button for me, subscribe to the channel. We're trying to get to 20,000 by the end of this year. At least we're nearing 10,000. We talk all things baseball, from baseball stories to baseball education to baseball reviews. We're gonna do a lot of things baseball here. So if you're interested in that, click that subscribe button and join the family. I'd love to hear your thoughts. So comment below if you have any stories similar to this, let me know, I wanna read them. Thank you guys and I'll see you in the next video.